So with all of the hosts in Westworld, everything is done with an eye towards deceiving the guest. They should look and feel as real as possible. We wanted to see what a host would look like if you stripped all of that away. That they didn't have to fool anyone, that they could just be the essential version of themselves, which is to say robots, but robots expressed in biological material. I took what they had had last year, you know, the creation of the host with the white muscly tissues, and I said, well, it all should be based on this. It's your base model without the covering. They don't need covering. They don't need eyes because they're these drones. When you take away something's eyes, when you take away its ears, when you take a human form and you get rid of the inessential, you create something that feels like us enough that you begin to attribute agency. You're looking for the soul in this thing and it's not there. What the hell is that? The drone hosts, that's not so much a visual effect. It's actually a really amazingly made costume. We have these big foam latex suits that we've been making for the drone hosts. We knew that we didn't want our actors to have to pretend they were interacting with someone. We wanted some reality. With a creature that requires almost no embellishment from our VisFX team to create a lasting, strong impression. And that's a tall order. It was a huge process. And I'm pretty excited to see it on film. Putting a performer inside it, Alex, who wears the suit, is, you know, he's six foot four and he's got like a 27 inch waist. And we have to corset him to make his waist even smaller. You move beautifully. It's really fun to work with the incredible actors who are our drone hosts. They are themselves just works of art, these tall, brilliant physical performers. One of them was actually a ballet dancer. You've never seen anything so strange and stunning as a drone host, you know, doing an arabesque. And the costumes were hard for them. You know, it's like being sealed in a Ziploc bag, I would imagine. It was a very physically taxing day. You know, I was looking around set one day. I was looking at, you know, these drone hosts walking around and just looking at the nature of this incredible set, and they're just really spectacular. And I'm looking around, I'm going, damn, we're doing real sci-fi here, man. This is the real deal. It's such a unique look, and something I don't think anyone has ever seen. With a really fun project. They pulled it off with incredible style. It's gonna be a whole new level of, wow. It's the stuff of nightmares.